Morning everybody, we are at Crite Tramway Village today. This will be the last use of our tickets we get in since we bought them last year. Uh, I just thought I'd show you what events they've got on and going on. So we've got uh, Magical May where they've got all the fairies and bits and pieces through the Waterland Walk. Then we've got the Coronation Celebration going into Seaside Fawn and all the way down. And then in August, I do think it's good how they put everything up that they're doing for the whole year so you can pick if you want to come on one of the special weekends. Uh, obviously they are open every weekend, even if it's not on the board. We've got a lot going on. So just to pop in the prices, um, so you've got them all there and the tickets are valid for 12 months so if we bought a ticket today it would last all the way until next April so there we go, we're going in. Right we're in, we're going down to the cafe, always the first stop on a day like this, go in, get a drink, maybe a snack, who knows. Uh, well, bacon cob I'm more thinking of, I'm not going to lie. Feeling like a bacon cob. Although you would probably have a sausage cob. Yes. And the kids will have whatever they fancy. <laughs> not a gingerbread man, yeah, because they never seem to eat it. Maybe like maybe like a, a jam on toast? No, not jam. Oh, yeah, trust me, jam is very messy and she's wearing pink and white and yellow today. So, hmm. we'll, we'll debate that, we'll debate that. Yeah, we'll, we'll look at the trams in a bit though. We're going to go get a drink. Um, and maybe a snack. That's it then, right? It's hungry. So let's go. Right, and we're at the calf. Let's go and see. Oh. Right, we're in the calf. I've shown the menu quite a few times, but just in case. And they also have the kids' menu for lunch as well. Right then, so I got a flavoured water today because I just wanted a bit of a change. And um, that was £2. And then I've got a bacon roll, which they said is going to be about 10 minutes. And that was £4 for bacon roll. Kids have got a nice bit of flapjack. What, what is it? Like shortbread? Millionaire shortbread. shortbread that they're sharing between each other. And they've got a juice. And then we, mum and dad have got a cup of tea. And mum went with a bacon roll, not a, not a sausage one today. So we've had a bit of a change. Is that your way? Yeah? <laughs> right, just thought I would show you which trams are out today. So we've got the big one out today. The one that I like to call the promenade one. And then they've also got one of the blue double deckers. So we're very excited. There is another one, but I believe it's already gone up. So we will see that one in a little while. But I do like this one. It's one of my favourites. And the lights do light up when it is um, darker in the afternoon, evenings. Uh, and they're open still to half past five. They do have the lights light up. So I think that's pretty cool. Well, my dad's just come and pointed out to me that in the window of the... Is it the sweet shop? 
Yeah, they went to the sweet shop. They've got all these old tins. Boxes. It's ever so good. Like, I did not know that Ritz crackers came in a tin. I thought they always came in a box. But apparently not. <laughs> right, and we're off. There we go. The tram, the one that went up before us. Be on that one in a bit. Nice and blue inside. There's the sweetie shop. That's the tea room where we had breakfast. And that's the pub. We've been in there before, the Red Lion Hotel. Um, it's really nice in there. They do some nice sandwiches. Over there you've got the tram sheds. And straight ahead you've got the bridge. And now we're going up, up and away. I made it to stop number one for the Woodland Walk, which is all through there. And there's one of the other trams, the enclosed top. It's very nice. Go on that one in a bit too. Now we're going to continue up to the top. Let's go. before and you 
we'll have an entertaining time now. Um, we don't turn the tram around, we're going to turn you guys around. So, starting in an orderly fashion from this end, and then just do it in a Mexican wave. Minding your knees and fingers. Turn the seat over, move around, and then carry on along. Now change side. And we're at the back. Is that cool? Why am I not in the <laughs> now we're at the back. Did you like this ride? Yeah. Right, we're back at the tram sheds now. Um, I've done I've done an up and down in here looking at all of them so I will link the first trip we did here um, below so that you can see them all um, I do like this one a lot and I very much wish they would have it out more often but they don't because um, it's one that I've not been on I've done a lot of them this one this was in the last one I believe or the one before I'm gonna. I'll just link all the ones below that we've done, but I'm pretty sure that this is the one we went on last time. Um, and we sat up top. We like to sit up top on these things. But well, they did say they had have had a bit of a move around. Uh, I know we've definitely been on that one, 106. Um, it's been a while, but we've definitely been on it. But yeah, they said they've had a move around for the. Um, King's Coronation, uh, which is coming up next weekend. They've had a couple of trams out and about um, and doing some switching and some changing. So a few of these have moved around. I do like coming here. It's just so nice. It's a peaceful day and it's just uh, cheap and cheerful, to be honest. You get free rides on the trams. We'll obviously pay for them, I suppose, but you get as many rides on the trams as you want. It's just a nice and relaxing day, to be fair. So, in that building is the soft play, and in there is the exhibition hall, which is where we'll be heading up to in a minute. We're moving one of the trams around. As we speak. No, it's, 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 it's being moved. Moved it out of the shed. Why? Don't know why. Maybe they just want to manoeuvre it around a bit. Yeah, probably getting ready for next weekend. Oh, it's manoeuvring again. It's going backwards now. Oh, now they're breaking it. I think it's gonna go up there to change track, maybe. Let's see. Right, they're moving it again. Oh, there's another one going past and all. Like taking it out. And out the gates it goes. Right, we're inside the exhibition hall now, aren't we, Viola? Yep. We're just next to the Blackpool tram, the one that's got like the Nickelodeon it's land and everything on. And it's really got spare pants. That we've got only part of Can you see SpongeBob? Yeah. Oh, yeah, there he is. Hiding is eh? Yeah. Mm. Look, it's a seat. You have to lift it and goes all the way over and sits down. Yeah, it's like one of Up here, look. Oh. Yeah. Wait a minute, Robin. Wait. Go on then, quick. Wait, side you're going this side. Robert, ride it this side. Ooh. 
can actually come and sit on this one. Are you sitting? Sit down then. Sit down and watch a bit of telly. Are you watching telly? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know, just have a look at the sign outside. Robin's watching telly. <laughs> right, we're going to explore the other side of the train tram now. Oh, oh yeah, the window is open. Hold on. Yeah, they do they do switch over, but I think they've stuck them in this way for a reason. Should we go and have a look what else we can find? They come in. Tell me about it. Like that one. There you go. Right, let's go then. Oh, why is that broken? It's not broken. That's just a handrail for you to hold on to. Oh dear. And we're off again. We'll just some cool looking trams. Come on then, let's go down here. Look at all these chairs, look. Oh, oh yeah, all these chairs. Yeah. Wait, is that horse or people that have gone No. <laughs> Got some colouring pages here, if you want to sit and colour. Yeah. <laughs> That one. There's your colours then. I'm going to have a colouring moment. So as you can see, it is a really big exhibition hall. It starts off around here. We've got the 1860s, 70s, 80s, 90s. And then... Around here I've got 1910s, 1920s, 1940s and 1950s. So there is a whole, whole area. And again, I've done like a full tour. I've looked around all of them. Um, I'll link them below. And if you want to have a look, you're welcome to. Right, they're inside the indoor play area. She's going to the slide. Right, Robin wasn't a fan. She's just playing on these little stepping stony type things. <laughs> She's having fun. Riley is God knows where up the stairs or oh no, he's there, look. Off he goes again. He's made friends. I think they're just racing round and onto the slide and then back down again. Yep, there he is. Right, she's going in the little play area. She's going to go down this little brown slide. There she goes. <laughs> That's more her comfort. There they are, they're both playing on it now. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> she did a good jump. That's it, he's down. Oh, she's going back. Go on, follow Riley. No, she, Robin's not having none of that. She's changed her mind. Hey, oh, she's back on the little brown slide. <laughs> she's not really sliding anywhere. 
Right, there we go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Go. Woo! Come on. Keep going. Woo! <laughs> Yay! Finally. <laughs> It only took us about 20 minutes to get to do that. Right, we've stopped for dinner in the pub. The kids have got the kids' meals. They've got cheese sandwiches. Uh, Dad's gone for ham and Mum's gone for cheese and tomato. After having the bacon cob, we're just going to try some of these. See if they're any nice. And just got a bottle of Coke. Right, so these ones were quite nice. They tasted a bit like frazzles. But a harder crisp these ones on the other end they didn't really have much flavor like they, you could taste a bit of lemon at the beginning but then that's about it so those ones were better right we're out from dinner nurse tram's just taking off and we're gonna go down here and get on the next tram off it goes Right, we're going in here now, um, just while we wait for one of the trams. I've done a full tour of in here as well, so I will, again, like I say, I'll link the previous videos down below, as there is a lot of information in here, and I went over all of it. And there's a big map in here as well. Nottingham is in here somewhere. Just don't remember where it was. But I saw it. There, <laughs> right in front of my face. These are Nottingham trams. <laughs> yeah, that's what our trams look like. Those ones up there. Again, they've got like a little kids area. And then in here, it's all photos of trams. And paintings. Sitting, they're chilling. Yeah. yeah, not bad. Right, here comes the tram that we're going to get on. It's an open top blue tram. Well, say this is London. Yeah, Twickenham. That's London, way, isn't it? Means, oh yeah, London. There we go. It's a London one. And we're off on the open top one, aren't we? Riley, do you like the open top ones? Yeah. Not really when it's raining. Well, not when it's raining. No, that wouldn't be very good, would it? <laughs> Lucky for us, it's not raining, is it? It's nice and sunny. The sun's come out to um, to play. Yeah. Yeah. At the park. At the park, yeah. We're gonna go on the park soon, aren't we? With me. With you, yeah, sure. Don't with me. So you can see the pole. All up there. No. Because if you drop my phone and off the tram, then we won't have a camera. <laughs> I'll let you take some photos on it. Yeah? Does that sound good? Me too. Yeah, not on the tram though, in a bit. Don't quite trust that she won't drop it. And there is, you can't quite tell, but there is a slight gap there. So if she was to drop it on the floor, it would quite easily go underneath there. So, um, yeah. But up there is the park. We're going to go on that one in a bit. It does look very good. We've had fun on the park before. Yeah. 
So yeah, we're just gonna go up on the tram again. I'll show you coming back down because we are right at the back. So I'll show you coming back down. I do like a little time lapse of us coming back down from the top. Love it. Go on then, Riley. That's it. We could sit the same side. Go on then, Robin, go round to the front. Good girl. Take <laughs> me now. Yeah. We're in the front. Right, we didn't make it all the way down. We got off with the bandstanders because the kids wanted to go to the park. So that was oh, pretty much all the way down, just missing out the bottom bit. Yep, got to go up this hill to the park. Are you excited? Got to go up this hill to the park. Can you make it? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> up we go. What's your story? What's your sign? It's like we're twin flames in a different life Deep connection, lights a spark It's like you know me in the depths of my heart We're dreamers
that's your type Somehow I wanna know all about you Deep connection, lights a spark You already know me when we dance in the dark We're dreamers
we finished at the park and now we're gonna go and get an ice cream we think although clearly they didn't run off enough energy at the park because they're still running <laughs> Right, we stopped off for an ice cream. I got mint chocolate chip with a flake. <laughs> Robin's got bubble gum. Nanny got salt caramel. Dad got a chocolate tub and Riley did have a magnum, but we finished that, haven't we? Don't. Is it nice? Don't, don't tip it. it Yummy? Mmm, nice. We can't eat it all. You're going to eat it all, are you? Very good. Right, we're on the last tram of the day. It's the enclosed top one. I'll show you when we get to um, off. We've got on, and now we're heading up. Nearly as a car. Yeah. Nearly as a car. 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 Nearly as a it was yummy, wasn't it? Yeah. Right, we're in the shop. Riley, what are you spying? I've spied that one what you got. Yeah, you got that one, haven't you? You bought that last time I was here. Yeah. What's them? Just a bag of a police car and um, and that. A fire truck. You've already got them though, haven't you? So what are you thinking then this time? Think you could get a tram. I don't know. Ah, this tram looks quite cool. And it does have wheels. Mm. Got some more over here. Not bad prices either. I mean, that's... 11.50, not bad. That one down the bottom is 14.50. <laughs> These like sets here are 10.50, not bad. Huh. Camper van and boat, nine pound, not bad. Well, I've hit Teddy's. Did you scan past these? <laughs> Sloughs. Ooh, wooden toys. These are good, $16.99. Don't mind paying more for wooden ones because they last longer. $9.99 for that. Mmm. Are you getting the dinosaurs? I mean, it's cute. It's only $7.99. Yeah, <laughs> Nanny said that you've got enough teddy bears and that we're not allowed to buy any more. Do not need any more tethers, seriously. How much is that? That one is 9 99 and you do have to build that. And I'm not very good at building those. I can build Lego, but like there's a lot of pieces in this. Let's have a look. No, it don't say. Um, it says age 14 plus, really, because yeah, you have to build it. And um. I just don't think I'd be very good at that, I'm afraid. And you got your little bits of these, see ya? This one has really good, I don't know if I can get it. Why? Like, I just put it through. You're tasting, eh? Come here, Robin. Yeah, we'll go to the toilets in a minute, okay? That's not a toilet, no. Got some train bits in here. <laughs> so that was just in the uh, the Forge shop. Uh, souvenirs and bits and pieces. Literally right across from the sweet shop and the tea room. Um, and down there in that one, that's where you get your ice cream. But we're just having a nice little trottle now. <laughs> Um, back upwards to the front so we're going to be heading out very soon Right Robin what did you buy at the shop? Yeah. Wow So you got a tram and a sign and we think this is like sticky tape type thing that you can stick down and roll the tram on yeah. Is that it? Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, we'll do it. Yeah, we'll do it when we get home? Yeah. Yeah. Alright, Riley, what did you get from the shop? And I got a um, trap. Let's see. Which one did you pick? Oh, nice. A red one, lovely, lovely. Matches your top. Oh, yeah. Matches your top. No. There's the open top tram. We had fun today? Very good. Right, we've had a quick nip upstairs. From out there, you can come up the side. I'll show you when we walk through there, as you can see it. Come upstairs and Robin's found these little trains to play with, aren't you? Yeah. Yeah. That's it, you're on the train track, good girl. You have to match it up into the circle, that's it. Now put the next one in, and now the next one. That's it. Well done, now find a train. There's one just there, look. Robin, there look, get that one. That one. Yeah, get that one. Can you reach it, or do you need my help? <laughs> what about this yellow one here, look? Put that train track back. What about this yellow one here, look? Yeah, that one, that's a train. Choo choo! <laughs> but it's nice, they do have some colouring pages down here as well, and the crayons just there if you do want to do some colouring. But um, I've done a, I've done a full walkthrough up here also. Um, it's actually quite interesting. I do advise coming up here if you do get time to do so. Um, it's really interesting to see all before the tramway village. So like how there was like horse horses that pulled carriages um, and so on and so forth. It's definitely very interesting. And then I would advise coming up if you have time. This shows you what is here. So obviously we've got the tram rides and it shows you where to get on the tram rides. Then this is the workshop which is just through there. I'll show you through there in just a moment. Uh, the exhibition hall which was what we went in earlier with all the trams inside. Got the woodland walk which we did do last time and like I said I will link all the videos from previous visits here so you can see them all if you want to. But yeah. Oh, and just to point out, I don't think I've pointed it out today, but the trams are all dog friendly. So you can take dogs onto the trams. Um, and I just thought I would mention that because it's not something that you would know unless you come here often. But if you do have dogs, you can bring them and you can take them on the trams. But in a minute, we'll go through to the workshop. There you go, look, so this is what I mean, so it's like the old horse and pull carriages, omnibus things. And that shows you the horses pulling them down the track too. Right then, now we're going to go into the workshop. This is where they work on all the trams. As we came in earlier, we was at that door over there. Um, and they let us know that uh, there was a big oil mess and they were cleaning up all the oil. But this is where they bring the trams in to have them worked on, have them checked over, make sure they all work okay. Got the big motors here at the top to help. It's all very, very good. So up here there is a telly playing um, slides of one of the restorations of the trams. Um, so you can see that there was rust damage, there was rot, um, and they managed to restore it all um, and get it back up to use. I mean, like, there's the part of it, part of the Glasgow tram. 
just come over here there's a lot of writing here so if you do want to pause it just pause it right now um, and give it a good read it's quite informative and then, like I say this the slides up here where it is telling you exactly how they managed to get it all restored and getting it all fitted on so definitely worth coming into here and having a look into it it's really interesting so that was the window that we were sat in front of there's a bench in front of it so that's you've got all upstairs there and then if you go in through this door which is pretty much opposite the pub um, that takes you up to the viewing gallery for the workshop um, and there is just a little lift just there Robin's just chilling. My dad's just explaining some bits to Riley upstairs. And then I think we're heading home. Why, well, it's time to go home. Are you showing me a picture? Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Right, that's us finished for today. Hope you've enjoyed. Thanks for watching. And we'll see you next week with a new video. Like, comment, subscribe. I'm coming. Bye. Bye. Bye.